The Porter Mobile is growing. Just to give you an idea how much, refrigerated cargo at the port has grown by nearly 50%. Another good sign for growth, the intermodal rail volume more than tripled from last year. NBC 15's Kim McGrath is on that story tonight. Ken, state and federal funding has helped get the port to this stage. Yeah, that's right, Kim. Now, the Port of Mobile, they're already moving in the biggest vessels they can, and it's about to get even better. It's an exciting time for us. We, we're one of the fastest growing ports in the country, uh, the fastest over the fa last five years uh, in terms of number of containers moved uh, percentage-wise. Um, so it's exciting. Rick Clark is the deputy director and chief operating officer for the Alabama State Port Authority, and he says the port is breaking records. The amount uh, that's moving now is significant. We're, we're moving, uh, last month moved the third highest amount of containers in our history. Clark points out the growth is helping build a better future for the port. So this $400 million investment, not just from the Fed, but the state as well, uh, to help bring improvements that will help us bring these bigger, uh, larger ships here. Clark tells NBC 15 News the import and export cargo growths are going to continue to grow because the population is getting larger. And with that larger population, there comes more good news. 25% year over year growth in um, container movements uh, here in the port. Uh, so really significant. Uh, a lot of jobs, a lot of opportunity. Clark says even before the pandemic, the port was doing well, and now it's just getting better. Right now, Clark says they have an intermodal facility that improves containers by rail, and it's growing significantly, 200% year over year. We are served by five class one railroads here that can pretty much take you anywhere in the country. Now, Clark says one of their focuses right now is to deepen and widen the channel so they can bring those bigger ships in. Reporting live in Mobile, I'm Ken McGrath, NBC 15 News.